Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, everyone. We'll start soon, okay? Let's we'll give a couple of minutes for the latecomers. We'll start in a few minutes. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, let me go here to the attendance list. Good evening. Thank you. 
Okay, people, let's get started this evening. I'm going to take the attendance, so please respond when you hear your name, okay? Alejandra Elizabeth Duran. Present. Okay. Alejandra Maria Lemus. Andrea Esmeralda Flores. Beautiful. Angelisa Axibrian. Blanca Estela Lara. Carlos Ernesto Rogel. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Edgardo de Jesús Maldonado. Present. Okay. Elba Esmeralda Figueroa. Present, Okay. Juan Carlos López Escobar. I hear teacher. Okay. Catherine Joana Calzadilla. Uh, no. Present. Okay. Kenia Roxana Ayala. Luis Miguel Mejía. Presente, teacher. Okay. María Delmi Hernández. I'm here. Okay. Marvin Alejandro Landa Verde. Present, teacher. Okay. Noé de Jesús Ambrosio. <clears throat> Not here. Sandra Lisset Elizondo. Present teacher. Okay. Cindy Carolina Cruz. Here. Okay. Ursula Yamilet Cornejo. I'm here teacher. Okay. Jensi Carolina Magaña. Okay, let's continue with this. Well, last class we studied the simple path and some questions. Today we are going to study this. Okay, but first. Let me ask you for this picture. Look at the picture next to the conversation, okay? And tell me what you see in the in the picture. It's a beach. Uh, beach. Man surfing. He is surfing. Okay. Then surfing. They're surfing. Hmm? Is that a, a competition or just for fun? They're surfing just for fun. Competition, competition because they I I they are waiting for their their turn. Okay. I think that is a surfing test, like press. Yeah, okay. You see here it says surfing contest. Surfing contest. Yeah, that is a contest means a, a competition, okay? Okay, very good. Very good. Now let's take a look to the conversation. Let me read the conversation for you the first time. So listen, please. This is a conversation between Celia and Don. I will record it here for you. 
kita conversation I done how was your vacation it was excellent I went to Hawaii with my cousin we had a great time lucky you how long were you there about a week fantastic was the weather okay not really it was cloudy most of the time but we went surfing every day the waves were amazing so what was the best thing about the trip well something incredible happened you won't believe it okay there you are Let me read it one more time. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time. But we went surfing every day. The waves were amazing. So what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredibly happened. You won't believe it. In this conversation, with this conversation, well, we are going to study the past form of the verb be and questions with the past form of be. You see, we have this. How was your vacation? It was excellent. How long were you there? About a week. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time. Uh, what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredibly happened. You won't believe it. Okay, let's see. So you see, these are questions with was, statement was, how long were you there? Was the weather okay? It was cloudy. What was the best thing about it? Ah, there is another sentence. The waves were amazing. The waves were amazing. All these questions and sentences are with the past form of the verb be, right? Let's take a look to that here in this grammar. We have here these uh, questions. The first set of questions here are what we call yes, no questions because we respond them with yes or no, right? Were you, were you in Hawaii? Yes, I was. Was the weather okay? No, it wasn't. Were you and your cousin on vacation? Yes. We were. Were your parents there? No, they weren't. So if you notice, we start all of these yes, no questions with was or were. That is the first thing in these questions, okay? And the short answers. Yes, I was. No, it wasn't. Yes. We were, no, they weren't. 
the second set of questions is are information questions or questions with question words like how long or how. So there are more question words like what, where, when, who, etc. How long were you away? So we cannot respond with just yes or no. We have to give information. I was away for a week. How was your vacation? It was excellent. Okay. Also remember that the yes no questions have a rising intonation. The intonation goes up. Were you in Hawaii? Was the weather okay? Were you and your cousin on vacation? Were your parents there? And the information questions have falling intonation. Yeah? How long were you away? How was your vacation? See, the intonation is different, okay? Are you in Hawaii? How long were you away? Was the weather okay? How was your vacation? Any questions so far? Mm, no. It was a question. Okay. I have a question. Uh -huh. I have a question. Tell me. Okay. In, in the first sentence, uh, it say, "Where are you in Hawaii?" Mm -hmm. And the answer is, "Yes, I was." Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, it used where? Where you? I I think it's a plural. But the, the answer it was just I was. Well, remember that you may be plural or singular. Okay. Okay. So, and it's the same, it's the same, right? Because uh, we, we only know if it is singular or plural by the context of the situation or the conversation. Okay. There is, um, okay, so it's, it is impossible just watching a sentence if it is sing singular or plural, so the we need a context to know if that you is singular or plural, but it's exactly the same. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Any other question, people? No? Okay, if you don't have more questions, let's complete this conversation with was or where. Okay, let me share this in WhatsApp. Share this exercise. And I'll give you time to complete the questions. Actually, I will send you to working groups to complete the conversations together and to practice the conversation, okay? Those are short conversations. So complete them and practice them. Oh, 
Okay, join the breakout rooms, please. Complete the conversation. And when you finish them, practice. Practice the conversations together. See you in around 10 minutes.
Okay. Okay, let's check your work. Let's see. Number one, how long? Here? Where? 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 Okay. Click on here. How long were your parents in Europe? They were, were, were there, there for two weeks. Two weeks. Here? Were they were were they, they, they were were they not No, they were were they, were they, were they. they also went to Paris. Okay, number two. Where are you? In Los Angeles. Where are you? Last weekend? No, I wasn't. wasn't. No, I wasn't. I wasn't. I was in San Francisco. Okay. How was it? How was it? How was it? It, it was great. Was great. It was great. But it was hot. And, and cool. Okay. Where you all? Where you? Where you? Were you away? Was week? Yes, I. I was. I was. What? In Istanbul. Istanbul. Really? Where? How long? How long were, you there? were you there for almost a week? I, I was there. I was there on this. Okay. Let me record the, the three conversations. Oh, you can track. Conversation one. How long were your parents in Europe? They were there for two weeks. Were they in London the whole time? No, they weren't. They also went to Paris. Two. Were you in Los Angeles last weekend? No, I wasn't. I was in San Francisco. How was it? It was great. But it was foggy and cool as usual. Three. Were you away last week? Yes, I was in Istanbul. Really? How long were you there? For almost a week. I was there on business. Okay, very good. Any question with these conversations, people? No. All right. You're clear. Okay. Now we have some questions here. But you have to respond first. Well, the idea is to practice in groups again with these conversations, talking about real information about you. But first, I will give you time to respond to questions, okay, with real answers with real information about you okay let me read the questions first where did you spend your last vacation where did you spend your last vacation myself i spent my last vacation uh in um suchitoto city or Using was or, or where? Well, I was 
in Suchitoto City. How long were you away? Well, I was away just for three days. I was away for three days. Who were with you? Uh, my wife was with me. My wife. What did you do there? Well, we walked around the town. We went for dinner. We visited a... Uh, um, what's the name of this? Uh, Cotto, Alejandro Cotto's house, a beautiful house. Um, we went to Suchitlan Lake. Okay, that's it. How was the weather? Well, the weather was a little bit hot, but nice. It was nice weather. Um, it didn't rain. Sunny. It was good. How was the food? Uh, most of the of the places we visited, the food were the food was great. Only one place we didn't like it, but most of the places, the food, most of the restaurants, and the food was great. Do you want to go there again? Actually, yes. Uh, I would like to go again because it's a very quiet town and you can have a relaxing day there okay that's about me so i will give you time to to respond to questions to take some notes or to be ready when you come to your groups to practice okay so i will give you five minutes to respond to questions individually and after that i will send you to work in groups again to practice asking each other these six questions, okay? Go ahead then and respond to questions individually, please. I will send you the questions to WhatsApp. Okay, there you are. Take around five minutes to respond, okay? Or to write some notes uh, about your answer.
Okay, now I will send you to practice in groups using those questions, okay? Okay, take a few minutes to practice asking those questions each other in your group.
Okay, people, welcome back. I hope you had time to practice a little bit with these questions. It is time to, to stop tonight. Uh, we're going to come back until Monday 7th. So enjoy your holidays. Be careful, behave. Okay. And see you next Monday. Teacher, una pregunta. Yes. La plataforma tiene que estar llena para esta semana o para la próxima. Uh, ahí les han estado poniendo en el grupo de WhatsApp hasta mm. dónde deben de sí. estar. Pero no, no, semanas. es que no nos pusieron, bueno, yo no vi que me hayan puesto fecha. Probablemente tenemos que trabajar para no atrasar. ¿no? Sí, o sea, dice lo que debe Ajá, de solo dice semana. Semana 2, completar sección 3 y mil, mil for example. O sea, es para esta semana. Sí, esta semana. Sí. Ah, ok. Va. Gracias. Ok. Good night. Good night. Good night, people. Good night, teacher. Good night, Monday. Monday. Good vacation. Bye -bye. Take care, everybody. Good night.